Today we'll be visiting Ale Mall 3, the biggest mall in Phnom Penh. Here we will be dining in my opinion at the best Japanese barbecue in Phnom Penh. Also we will be witnessing how Roro ice is made right in front of our eyes. We will also be checking out the famous entry market in Phnom Penh Namaka, one of my favourite places to buy souvenirs. Unfortunately, Central Market was not my favourite place because it was super high inside. However, it was a good experience that ultimately led us to No Coffee, one of the finest places for dining and coffee nearby. We will also be checking out our Hotel Sky Bar rooftop where we can see nearly all of Phnom Penh. So hope you enjoy the video guys, see you at the end! Eon Mall 3 is famous for being the largest mall in Phnom Penh at the moment. It only recently opened to the public. The grand opening was on the 7th of April last year, 2023. The other two Eon Mall in Phnom Penh is slightly smaller. In the last 10 years Phnom Penh has seen a great number of shopping malls popping up to accommodate the growing number of people moving to the city from the countryside in search of better opportunities. One of the coolest thing that caught our attention was this big slide. It's made to slide down from the third floor to the second floor. That is super cool. The mall also offers many different range of shopping categories from fashion, sports, home and living, books and stationery, and gadgets and electronic appliances. And our favorite, there are many cafe and restaurants options to choose from. Happy hour? Happy hour. Mao man. Okay. Of course. Many restaurants were offering happy hours between 12 to 5 pm. Certain foods were 50% off. What a good timing. Our visit here just made it more fun and exciting. There were so many yummy restaurants to choose from, but in the end, we decided to eat at Kinton Buffet, Japanese barbecue. Most of these set packs here is included in the happy hour.
food looks like it is kept nice and cool to keep its freshness. We ordered six sets of mixture of beef, pork, chicken and seafood set. Each set came with rice, a drink, soup and a few side salad each. Original price range from $5.90 to $6.90 each set. With happy hour it brought it down to 50% off. We enjoyed our lunch here so much. The food, the customer service, and the cooking experience is a big 10 out of 10. We will definitely come back again. Hey guys, just a quick one before we continue with the video. A lot of you that are watching are not yet subscribed, so if you are enjoying this video and you want to see more coverage of us traveling around, then please do subscribe. Also, hit the thumbs up button. It will help us with the YouTube algorithm. Okay guys, I'm not gonna take too, up too much of your time. So let's get back to the video. For dessert, Chloe decided to try out Roll Roll ice cream. Chloe ordered the berry berry strawberry flavour.
On the ground floor there is Eon Supermarket. It looks very new and modern. Ryan went back for his favorite mango sorbet at Swenson Ice Cream. We are staying at 12.01. Looks nice. We'd be staying at Sim Boutique Hotel Phnom Penh for a couple of nights. Okay, this is our room guys, 12.01. On my left is the bathroom. Oh, looks nice. Bathroom oh, looks nice. Toilet, shower, bathtub. Got a double bed here and a king here. Nice room. TV, fridge. Okay, we're on level 12. Hello. Yeah, hello. Hey. Good We are heading to check out Sora Yar Mall, the first shopping center to open in Phnom Penh with escalators. Sora Yar Mall was opened in 2003. It seems pretty quiet, not many people here at all. With many newer options of shopping mall to go to now, could explain why it is pretty quiet. We took a photo with a mini replica of the Independence Monument. It was built in 1958 to memorialize Cambodia's independence from France in 1953. Heading to breakfast.
hot porridge. They seem to sell everything here. Whatever you need, you should be able to find it here. Alright, we're here at the market and we're all sweaty. It's so hot in here. It was super hot, especially more in the middle of the market. There was no airflow and ventilation. We were all sweaty. Oh here, there's more here. What do you mean there on Jung? Mean uh sat a sat a man tick more than chicken. You mean the hint from Tom Bong? Do you have a pool that like does it have this on it? Oh, that mean a pool or mean a cow? No, no, no. Just the island. The island. What? 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 Oh no, not that one. I think. No, we just walk around, dog. We having fun. Oh, we are sweating. Everyone here is sweating. Chloe, look like you look like you. Ryan, are you sweating? The yes. I think I don't know if get the thing here, the big one. I'm not as sweaty as mom. Apart from the heat and sweat, we had a very good time here. Customer service from all the stores we visit was exceptionally friendly and kind and helpful. We highly recommend Phnom Penh Central Market a must visit. Ryan is very happy and loves his souvenirs collection he bought from the market.
right outside the central market, we found a small store that sells fresh coconut. The store was set up at the front with their home connected at the back. It's a cool way to have a business and save on rent. The coconut was so good and fresh. We all felt so much better after the coconut. Just around the corner from the coconut store, we walked into this place called Noir Coffee at TTP. It looks small from the outside, but it's actually big and spacious in the inside. There is also an outdoor garden area to enjoy your meal and coffee. As it was close to lunch, we decided to try out their lunch menu. That was a very delicious lunch. The food was very fresh and tasty. Prices was also very cheap for such a nice place. We will definitely be coming back. Highly recommend this place if you are in Phnom Penh. Heading to Phnom Penh Night Market. Because it was only three of us, we decided to try out the three wheel tuk tuk. It is slightly cheaper than the normal tuk tuk.
live performance by local Khmer singers are performed here on stage on certain nights. There are many seating area to eat and enjoy the night with good food and music. Being a night and outdoor market, it is much cooler than the day inside market. Ryan was looking for more souvenir stalls to buy. However, it seems like there is mainly clothes and shoe stalls here. They also have watches. Ryan decided to buy more mini gold brass animal souvenirs. On the way back to the hotel we decided to take the normal tuk-tuk instead of the three wheel. It is more spacious and have lots of air and wind keeping us cool. We can see the famous Cambodian National Olympic Stadium from here.
Phnom Penh city night view looks so beautiful from here. If you enjoy a couple of drinks and food, and also the beautiful night view of Phnom Penh, then this place is a must visit for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed our video. If you haven't already done so, check out our channel for other Cambodian videos. Also, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell button. It would help us so, so much. Until next time, take care. Bye for now. Peace. Peace.